Ceiling fan blowing cold breeze on your body I can't tell you really what it is, but you got it Make up in the morning, you got dresses in your closet But you grab them tights, you in love with being modest You a move, body I'm giving no shit reviews I'm just saying I'm amused But you ain't even flexing And you cool, tat it up, cover wounds Different vibe, you know and But you ain't even flexing And you ain't gotta try to hard Yeah, they break that thing in a real quick then. Hey, I wanna look at the color, color of the stone again. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gotta stick it on the side like that. Mm-hmm. Come on. You got a five foot bump out. So that's why we're gonna put our little mud area. Make it pretty in there. Mm hmm If I can't have you, I don't want you to have anyone. And if you don't want me, there's something wrong with them, right? Maybe I got problems that I don't tell anyone Have I lost my perception? Feel like I wanna do something wrong now Packing all your belongings Say you wanna take some time But if you say we'll meet again Why'd you have to take everything now?
Taylor Manor. <laughs> Welcome to the empty house tour of, like I said, Taylor Manor. But first, we're gonna look, when you enter into the house, you enter into the two-story foyer, or like most people say, foyer. And up there at the top, you see like a little niche where you can actually put a picture. We're thinking about painting that. Then to your, my right, you have an office with double doors. And like I said, this is not a full, this is not an empty house tour or a fully furnished house tour. This is a semi furnished, semi empty house tour. Cause we had to get the office set up because after moving of course, so I had a few more days before I went back to work, so. Still working on getting the office set up. And then of course, they point out the windows, you got the big picture window. Where they got it look like almost like three separate windows over there with the ledge. Almost floor the ceiling window. And then you come right here, of course, this is the two car garage. Still, like I said, we are have just moved up here, so three car garage, still getting organized. Um, then this little hallway leads to the laundry room. This is where Ario is currently at right now. He, y'all probably know about Ario. He barks a lot, so he's in here to the video get over. And once you come in here, this leads to the half bath, powder bath. They're trying to go bark now. Powder bath, half bath, visitor bath. There's a toilet and a sink. And then you come this way. Of course, I did point out about the floors. The floors are the wood-like tile. Actually, wind up the builder wind up upgrading these because the ones we had originally chosen was out. They no longer have them, so they upgraded to these. So these was upgrade floors, and we got them from. We had the option to have it put in all areas. I opt to put carpet in study or office. And then over there, of course, where the Christmas tree would go. And you see this fire staircase would we'll go up that short length. And over here, right now it looks like a landing zone. The sun is really bright, so you can really see with the light on, but this is the former dining room. Again, Floor to ceiling windows, large picture double windows. And then you leave out of the formal dining room and enter into the kitchen. Still learning what I like some stuff is in. Pantry to my right. Not the biggest pantry, but hey. 
It'll work, but pantry. Still working on getting it organized, so it's coming along. And then you had a kitchen. And it is an eating kitchen, of course. You got the breakfast nook. This is what we eat at majority of the time, of course. Former dining room would be more like for holidays, but this is an eating kitchen area. And then you come around here, you got the large island with the sink, cabinets, dishwasher. I'm in the process of actually change, gonna be changing these, so if you keep watching in a later later on with some of the home updates, you'll see that I change these out. I'm gonna change those to something different. Bar stools are gonna get changed, it's just that temporarily. Uh, we got the countertop, whirlpool stove. This is actually gonna get changed out also. Um, with the white countertops with little gray speck, <clears throat> gray specks in it. Kind of pulls the gray specks, the gray from the cabinets, which this color is called gunmetal for the cabinets. We got cabinets up here. Exposed hood, refrigerator. Um, Bosch refrigerator, I've talked about this prior. Um, we're actually gonna wind up changing all the appliances that's in the house to Bosch. So the dishwasher, stove, microwave and oven, which is Whirlpool also. We're gonna wind up changing this out to, oh, that's gonna need to get changed to Bosch. So we can just get a little more, something different. Um, Of course, you have the back porch, or what they call it, Texas size. Is it considered Texas size back porch? You didn't want to walk out there? <laughs> you got to it. Which y'all probably already have seen. Partial of this because he's been grilling since we moved out here. Got two lights up here. We're gonna probably add a ceiling fan because they didn't put the ceiling fan. You got speaker access back there in the back in the windows. And then you just have this nice pitch in the back so you can get out here and enjoy. Of course, backyard. Pool coming soon. Then we come back into, into what is called the great room. And it is a two-story great room. You have, you know, same floor. We had the same floor from front to back, all the way back. We even opt to have them put in the master, in the owner suite, but we won't see the owner suite today. Y'all see that in a later video, so I'm still working on it. But this is the great room. We just, just had this built in and put in over here with the cabinets and the shelves. Still trying to decorate. Um, yeah, fireplace, a porch right now. TV block and fireplace. Uh, but it's a gas burning fireplace with the stone. And then you have archways in the home. And leading to the owner suite, you have a niche we painted in and left this white. And of course, like I said, you'll see the other part once we get finished with the master bedroom. Bedroom. Wanna see the bath? Okay, and then you enter into the owner suite's bathroom. Double vanity, his and her vanities. Soaking, freestanding tub. Linen closet. Large walk-in shower with glass. Kind of sunken, it's like a sunken shower. 
toilet room. You can wait to see that. And then closet, which we are currently gonna be, well, right now we're just getting settled in, but we're gonna actually have this. All of this is gonna get ripped out, changed, so we can put a closet system in here. Make it work. Tonda, we're gonna change that chandelier out to something a little more grander for that area. And like I said, bedroom, bedroom, kids are asleep, so won't be showing the bedroom. Just a regular bathroom. Did you want to show the bathroom? Another mm -hmm. bedroom. Kids bath. That's your standard sink, vanity in me, shower combo tub with the towel, gray towel. As you can see, the color thing through this house was gray, black, and white. Coming together, and as you see, we just already got his pool table here. Um, this is another bedroom for the boys. They're asleep. One is up, but they're asleep. But this is a game room. Um, still gotta get it together. Like I said, this is not a fully. It's more of a semi furnished house tour. It's not done. We still got a long ways to go. Then, and we have also a pair of coins with the windows, keeping with the theme. We got plenty of sunlight, plenty of light, natural lighting. Three windows up here. Then you come around this way, and then you enter into what is considered the media room, theater room, man cave, you name it. Um, it's still coming along. We got the majority of this done, but of course we gotta change the seating. We just put our couch from our last house up here that we used to have in the living room. We just put it up here for right now till he get his seating um, that he's gonna want to put in here because he's gonna do the theater chairs. And you'll probably see the video of the Father's Day Juneteenth celebration where when 
his theater room was revealed to him, so you'll see that. But it's still coming along. He wants some more speakers to add to it. But you have the skunks on the wall. Little areas where you can actually put the posters. We try to figure out we want to put the posters right here in these bar, or do we just want to showcase a poster each right here in the big spot? So they got the big screen. It's chilly up here. Usually don't be chilly in here. I guess because the electronics not on right now. But that is pretty much it upstairs. semi-empty house tour um, that brings us to the end of it I hope y'all enjoyed it and also like comment and subscribe to the channel because uh, we're gonna be bringing more footage of where we decorate because hey we got more square footage lots of rooms to decorate bedrooms to reveal so definitely tune in so that is out this video and hey I gotta get back to work but That'll be all. Bye. <laughs>